if you guys have watched our videos, uh, more than one or two, you'll know that we tunnel under things. <laughs> um, there's a giant tree. We are tunneling under at the moment, yeah, oops. Um, so there's, a, there's a, a cluster of stuff down there. What's up guys, we're out digging again. There's Gabe behind me. We're clearing out our holes. It's cold, it's about minus three this morning. It's supposed to warm up, so it's kind of nice. We've got a few things showing. There's one possibly embossed one in a hole, so we're gonna get to showing you that. And Jay has, what do you have in the hole? Anything? I have a couple things. He has a couple things in the hole, so I'll meet you guys down there. Before we jump in the hole, we found uh, common stuff, nice blob top bottles. Very lovely, uh, just alcohol, another one there. Uh, International North Crowball Broken, make a cup out of that. This is a lovely uh, med, it's gonna be a purple med, quite nice. Uh, also, I want to show this, Jay found this, it was kind of in one of our trees. It is a bottle that had stuff still in it with water. And you can see it all frozen in the middle and created this weird looking ball. <laughs> That's actually really cool. I also found a gin bottle that I'm gonna imagine oh, yeah. breaking it. Oh man, look at that, he's so strong. <laughs> that'd be go fly. Yeah, that's how things flash crack, by the way, you get you get that in it. And uh, yeah, they they flash crack under the ground. Um, so deep in here, um, oh yeah, also, it seems that uh, when people arrived in this town, they were like, here's your complimentary barrel rings and buckets. Please go throw them out of the dump so future people will hate you. <laughs> There's another one down there, yeah. So that's probably what happened in this town. We got a big old bottle right here. Uh, that's a biggie. Oh, that's a real biggie. Holy cow. That's a large alcohol bottle. You can get right drunk off that. What kind of top does that have on it? Ooh, that's full of mud and, oh. <laughs> Man, that sound is just weird. Let's see the top on it. Oh, it's one of those weird looking ring tops. I don't know what they call it. It's applied though. But there you go. Very big bottle. There we go. Okay, so also we got oh, right here. Um doop -ba doop -ba doop -ba doop. And I kind of seen embossing on it. Ooh. Ooh, whoa, what is that? Yeah, it is a you were right, Jay. It was a Ralstone. You thought it might have been a Ralstone, but uh, cause it popped Let out. clean that off for you since yeah. I don't know how to read bottles. I don't know how to read bottles. It's probably a shoe polish though. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of stuck it back I down then once you've seen embossing was there. Polish or something. Uh, R. Say. Ralston and Company Manufacturers, Hamilton, Ontario. Very lovely. I do not have one of those yet, I don't think. That is very nice. There we go guys, so. Uh, man, I have music playing in my pocket. I really hope I don't get copyrighted strikes from that. Hopefully you guys can't hear it. But, um, there we go. Very nice. Uh, I think you guys can see it, but we'll catch you guys on the next one. Hopefully we'll find, find some more stuff like this. Now that I turn my music off, hopefully, again, you can't really hear it on audio. I don't get a copyright strike for that or something. There it is again. Uh, R. Ralstone & Co. Manufacturers, Hamilton, Ontario. Lovely aqua. Oh, it still has the applicator inside of it. Oh, look at that. You can see that that's not a fuzzy caterpillar. That's the old applicator, and yeah, the cork is still in there. So that was like a stove polish or shoe polish right there. Very cool. Okay, and Jay also pulled out a chow chow bottle. Wow, you're juggling chow. those. You're you're attempting fate, man. And then just another uh, alcohol bottles. Oh yeah, we found this real nice purple one here. I forgot about that. And hey, make make sure your stoppers don't go flying. Let's see. There you go. Oh yeah, that is a absolute. If it wants to focus, come on, hand. You and are the my top's focuser. The not purple, but the bottom is. Yeah. Look at that color. Yeah, well, it's a bit, but very nice. Oh yeah, there you go. There's the other one side by side, but lovely purple. Okay, so now that my music again is off, we're gonna keep going. Tons of barrel rings to pull out. Uh, I probably know why they stopped here, because of the barrel rings. So, um, catch you guys on the next find. More stuff showing up. Got an amber one there, weird base to it. Uh, still trying to get around all these barrel rings and uh, buckets. But this, uh, I just wanna show this too, look at this wood. It was covered in this, it looks like it was thrown out yesterday almost. So we'll get to this, I think there's one in here. We'll go with this one actually, there's one right here. It is a Halbrook. Oh, no, no, the bottom's still there. Probably uh, just a Worcestershire sauce or something like that. Worcestershire. Um, Worcestershire. <laughs> and this one here, oh, that's odd. Uh, whoa! Is that a Bovril? That is, that's a Bovril, bo 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 but wow! That's like the size. Of, that's like a, the size of a grapefruit. Yeah, let me clean that off. Oh my god! Yeah, here, please. Thank it's you. Not the, like lead steel on it too. I've never seen them that big before. I did not know they made them that big. That is real cool. Sixteen ounce. Let's see. Why wow, is it cracked? No, it's fine, eh? Wow. 
Oh, you gonna focus on the camera? That is huge! That's definitely a, definitely a keeper. Very nice. Very, very nice. That's neat. Looks like a little hand uh, grenade thing. thing. <laughs> Bobber in the hole, whoop! No, I'm kidding, there we go, very cool. Okay, uh, Jay also has I'm sitting on a something. pot. Oh yeah, Jay and his pot thing, his pot chair, I dump pot really chair. Aqua, I don't know, it looks- Oh yeah, let me get better footing, one sec guys. Oh, I don't wanna be making the camera go all over the place. Okay, I can, oh, here, I'll, I'll zoom in there because I can't really get over there. He's got that right there, so. Is it full? It is full. What is it, anything? Nothing? No, it's just a slick. Yeah, that's probably that. why, why it was in the dug layer, right? Look at that color. Yeah, past that, that is nice. Holy cow, yeah, that was left behind, that was in the dug layer. Uh, there we go, wow. That is beautiful, that color. Very nice. Wow, the camera just recognized the bottle as a face. <laughs> that is just, that's a haunted bottle. Okay, there you go, Jay. Very neat. Uh oh, applied top, top, also nice. Oh, we're gonna keep going, see what more comes out. Definitely that, uh, that's definitely the find of a while. I didn't know they made that big, very cool. See you guys on the next one. If you guys have watched our videos, uh, more than one or two, you'll know that we tunnel under things. <laughs> um, there's a giant tree. We are tunneling under at the moment, yeah, oops. Um, so there's a there's a, a cluster of stuff down there. But uh, first, I just wanna show, uh, that's just a bunch of those stuff we've been pulling out of here. Mostly common slicks and whatnot. Jay also has, here, move, I'm gonna zoom in really quick. Gin, Gin, bottle. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Gin bottle right there, very nice. Bloop, 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 bloop. You like my like my sound effects for zooming in? <laughs> and then we also found this one here, uh, a sauce of some sort. Should turn purple. Yeah, I haven't actually looked. I didn't actually look at that. It's gonna be purple or not. Okay, I got my phone set up, ready to go with a light. Oh, we're going way in here. Okay, there's a pocket of stuff. These are all beer bottle. I'll show them all later in a second. Another beer bottle here. These all literally just fell out. I did not place these here. Um, Sorry about the bad camera work. Ooh, gross. Okay, another one there. Um, I think that might be a cobalt bottle in there. Oh yeah, there's another one right here. Another one right there. Ooh, oh yeah, there's a case gin right there. That's the one I'm kind of excited about. Uh, oh, sorry guys, sorry about that. I'm hitting you guys. Yes, yes. Uh, is it full? Okay, it's full. Uh, it is embossed. Okay, it's gonna be a surprise. It is embossed, but it'll be a surprise when we get out there. Uh, and this one, yep. oh, I'm hitting the camera button or the photo button. Oh no, I don't want to do that. Ooh, very nice. Okay, I'll meet you guys outside because I'm gonna, it's gonna be wobbly getting out of here. Okay, very sorry about that bad camera work, but I was way the heck in there. That's why, sorry, I hit the camera a bunch of times. So this is what came out of here. We got whiskey, another whiskey, two, I think there are three parts. Yeah, those molds. are awesome three part molds here. I put them down the ground there. Uh, the one had a chip lip, I think. These are lovely three-part molds. I'll probably keep the the one, so you can see that. Uh, it's hard to. Is that a three-parter? Yeah, very faintly. Very faintly, yeah, because you can see the the middle ball, the middle or the bottom seam right there. Yeah, the very nice. Oh yeah, the McDonald's. That's the one, eh? That's the uh, pop bottle we pulled out. There we go. Very lovely. Whoop! Wants to focus on me. Very lovely the McDonald's. Yeah, it's not chipped. We got it. Very nice color. Oh yeah, the gin, the gin bottle, yes. Yeah, it still has the uh, the cork again in it, which oh, is very I just nice. It in further. Yeah, well, that's probably gonna have to get pushed in to be able to do anything. Good luck with that. Oh, it's coming out. Actually, though. Oh yeah, it is. You're right. Full of dump gin. Oop. Yeah, that's that's gonna take a bit to come it's... out. Ah, we'll get it later. And Jay also has another one in there. So I'll zoom in a bit. Blah, 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 blah. Zooming in sound effects. And is it full? And is it an applied top or not applied top? Ooh, it's an applied top. Woohoo, very nice. This dump is just full of these things. It's got the B on the, the bottom. The B, oh, I still, I should, I went to look at that to see what the comments said about that from last time. That we found one with the B. Very lovely and awesome color. Ooh, awesome color to it. Very nice, and again. Okay, no, I'm not gonna put it over things because I broke one like that before. Look at that, lovely applied top. Awesome guys, so we're gonna keep going. See what more comes out. Nice and bossed, local. So catch you guys on the next one. Getting a bit excited guys. Jay has a pot, or not a pot, a uh, alcohol bottle. He accidentally pulled it out because he thought it was just a regular slick one we've been finding all over the place. 
It's embossed. It's embossed. So I just yeah, it he shoved it right back in the hole. I'm pretty. We're pretty sure we know what it does. He he knows what it does. So uh, I'm zooming in on it really quick. That's it right there. That's exactly where it came out of. But like I said, he did he did pull it out. So. And then we got some of this in here. Oh yeah, there's one right there as well. And feels broken. I don't know. That's yeah, another it's one of those whiskey. whiskey. Okay, get to that. Get to pulling that other one. The embossed boy right there. Okay, and is it what we think it is? It's not yes. chipped, is it? Oh, <laughs> it is what we thought it was. Very nice. That's a. Uh, there's no cracks in it. Oh. There's there's a crack. Oh no, there's a little bit of a lip here. But it's oh. on the back. It's on the it's back. On the back. That's fine. That's one of those Reinhardt and companies, isn't it? Yeah. That's Reinhardt lovely. And company is Lager. Oh, there you go. We did find one of these before. There you go. Reinhardt and Co. Lager Toronto. A lovely amber to that boy right there. Nice. There we go, and yeah, that is, it's an applied top, but yeah, it has a bit of a sheer. I'll still keep that. Yeah, no, that's perfectly fine, that is, that's fine. It's on the, like I said, the, the embossing is on that side, it's on this side, so it looks perfectly fine. Very nice, Reinhardt & Co. Lager Toronto. Good find, very good find. Okay, well, I'll catch you guys on the next one. I don't think I have anything in my hole. Yeah, uh, there's just, again, complimentary buckets everywhere. Uh, buckets there, bucket there, bucket there. Barrel rings, another bucket, another bucket, bucket inside a bucket. Um, this is this is just a pain to dig through, guys. Like you guys see all the cool finds that we have, but you don't see us digging through all this. So, uh, not really complaining because it's fun, just hard. So we'll get back to you guys in a sec. I think this is going to be the last clip, and we're going to end the video soon. But okay, I just want to show this. It's been about a half hour ish. But this is all the metal <laughs> that we just yanked out of literally a two foot section. Oh. And we just pulled this out. What is it? Oh, nice! Imperial it's court. Imperial Court. Broken though, sadly. So, um, yeah. Uh, this is what we dig through to give you guys awesome, awesome content. content. Digging through this. Literally, the people who had free reign on this back in the 70s literally left this, and they left it for a good reason. Because oh, stuff's falling. Yeah, they left it for a good reason because this is just. Oh, it takes a while. It takes a while. Barrel rings and complimentary buckets. Welcome to town. Here's a bucket and barrel rings. Go throw them in the dump. Okay, we got a pocket here after cleaning all that out. I got my light going. We have one, two, three, four, maybe five and six in there. The light, it's the light's kind of probably terrible here. I'll show it really quick on here so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Uh, where's my light? There it is. Right in there. One and two. Set this back up so we can see uh, see a bit better. That is um, okay. Let's start pulling. Let's go with this one, I guess. Yep, it's full. Still has a cork in it as well. Lovely, nice aqua. Again, I'll show all these when we get outside here. Oh, Jay also hit a little pocket. Apparently, this one still has a paper label on. It's probably a jeez, oh, probably a Lee's. Uh, oh wow, dude, Jay, check out this. It has the paper label still on it. That's hey, chow, chow, chow Chow. It is Chow Chow. And it does have, it has Lee, so it's, it's Lee's Chow Chow, I guess. That's what it is. Lee's. That is very cool. That is neat. That is awesome. Okay, again, I'll show that better when we get outside. Very nice. Um, this is broken. This, I think, is another one of those. Yeah, it's another one. Another one of those. How many do you have? I don't know, man. We're gonna, we're gonna split these 50-50. Um, Okay, that's broken. Honestly, I can't see very well in there, but I think that's all of my had. There is one right here, which is Gordon's Dry Gin. Ooh, no. oh, that's, oh, it's a newer version. Ah, it's the newer version. That's fine, Gordon's Dry Gin. It is an applied top as well. Again, show it better when I get outside. Uh, and then there's one right in here. I think this is a mason jar. Whoa, is that embossed? No, it's not embossed. It's just a big old thing. Okay, so I'll meet you guys outside like here. Yeah, oh, oh, it does. Ugh, ooh. Pass that up here. Yeah, okay, well, I'll meet you guys outside. Give me a second. These are the ones we pulled out here. Uh, we also found those as well, They're just common ones. Uh, before we get to those, where are the ones you pulled out, Jay? Oh, that's kind of toss them there. Just toss them out there. They're common ones. Yeah, there's a pile. Okay, this so. Here, it has purple. Oh, yeah, it, has, it literally has purple. We, it's probably ink. Uh, it's going to focus for me. It's literally purple. Ugh, I'm going to guess ink. And I'm not too sure if the bottle itself is purple. I'll have to double check that later. Ugh. Just put purple food coloring. Yeah, there you go. Um, this one, that is very cool. The Chow Chow, Lee's Chow Chow. Let's stay in focus again. There we go. Very cool paper label. Um, 
and that's again Lee's. These are all purple bottles too. Very cool. That label, oh, I'll try to save it. I don't think we can, but we'll we'll try. Uh, the Groin's Dry Gin, it's, I don't know if this is a newer or older version, but it does have, it's a lovely applied top. Very lovely applied top. Groin's Dry Gin, uh, London, uh, England on it. Very lovely color to that one. Definitely a keeper. Um, and then these two whiskeys. Oh boy, Jay, what are you doing? This whole thing's coming down on him. Okay, uh, and then these two lovely ones. Well, let's see. Oh, that is nice. That's a cute little purple jar. Check that out. Uh, yeah, oops. A little purple jar. Very nice. So, um, I think we'll do a wrap up for you guys and show what we found today, along with all our metal. Oh, man. Second barrel, barrel ring central. So, I'll catch you guys at the wrap up. Well, the wrap up for today, guys. Here's a ton of the uh, common ones that we found. We also have uh, that one too. Also found what now? We also have our ever growing. Pile oh of yeah, the ever growing pile of whiskey bottles. Dun dun dun. Which I'm gonna be taking, by the yeah, way. Yeah, this kid takes them. I don't know why. He literally his apartment is just boxes of bottles. You are insane, good sir. Um, okay, so that's just again common bottles, stuff like that. Dirty old phone right there, full of dirt. Um, we need to invest in a flashlight. And the finds from today, we also found these earlier. Oh yeah. Check, that would have been Ooh, a nice That would have been real nice. That was an ink actually. And it was, all the pieces were there, it was busted. We found a full plate. It's got like a nice little leaf decal. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, it does. Very nice. Don't really find full plates. Yeah, you don't find often. plates. Oh, what's on the bottom? What's that Maker's Mark? Uh, Wilkinson Limited England. Very cool. Very neat. Uh, we got the Gordon's Dry Gin. Quite uh, nice. We got uh, McDonald's and Company Cobalt. The old stuff oh, stuff's falling. falling. <laughs> uh, we got two, I think they're whiskeys, Kilman Rock whiskey, I believe. How do you know that? I think it says on the bottom. Does it? Huh. I'm learning stuff today. Oh, maybe it does. It does say something on the bottom. Uh, huh. We got that purple filled thing. <laughs> the disgusting purple filled uh, one. Bovril. Bovril. We got uh, oh, yeah. shoe polish or stove polish. With I got the, the applicator out of it, yeah. Applicator. Oh, lovely chow chow bottle. Yeah, I was going to show this one a little bit better again. Very lovely bottle. Very lovely. Okay, moving on. What was it? Oh yeah, the Chow Chow. Chow Chow. I don't think that label can be seen. No, it's... I'll try, but I highly doubt it. Um, when did you find this one? Uh, I honestly don't know. It was just kind of sitting around here. We got a gin bottle. Very nice. Very nice colors. And we have my stuff oh yeah, here. Jay's lovely we, stuff. We, we utilized one of the old buckets. Those Dump ones. bucket. Yeah, we've used those quite a few times. Uh, this one's my one of my favorites. Oh yeah, that is a lovely one. That's, that's like mint condition. It too. is. The lovely applied top gin, and then I think the find of the day, yeah, the, the Reinhardt Ryan Co. 100%. That's the find of the day right there. That's a lovely boy right there. Lovely bottle boy. There we go. And then uh, that really nice aqua. Really nice aqua one. That's a very nice color though. That is. That's quite nice. There we go, guys. So we'll catch you guys on the next video, and uh, we'll see what more we can find. We're gonna start another one up for you guys for next week, and we'll see what we find then. So catch you guys on the next video.